How's it going, hunters? Welcome back to Let's Platinum Red Dead Redemption 2. We're actually back here at camp because there is a coach robbery that we can do with Micah. Uh, yeah, yeah, we're coming in. Shut up. You see who it is. Jesus Christ, you moron. Alrighty, looks like Micah's ready to do that coach robbery. Let's get back there and talk to him. What's up, Micah? You ready to what rob a stagecoach? Always full of sunshine, ain't you? Oh, yep, yeah, it's coming right out my good old derriere. Well, I got a rainbow shooting out of that good old brown hole. Arthur, I want hope. I want oh my God! Today. I want this whole Michael, figure out how to get me some money or shut up. I Hope y'all are having a fantastic day. If you're enjoying this series, remember to I like, subscribe, click that notification bell, and drop a comment no. down below. So, instead of that, how about you? Instead of what? Go and redistribute some property heck yeah yep. let's go get some of that wealthy man's uh coach company you know into wealth pockets and uh you yeah yeah time, I always fight. No, you I run always away talk, but with coaches guns are more significant than words oh I'm yep fine every time both, friend yeah. come on then <laughs> all right let's go you think we need an extra gun? Probably a good idea. Bill, come on! No, we don't need no extra gun. You got me. Okay. Yep, death sentence. I knew it. Every time we take Micah out, something goes wrong. Every time we take Bill out, something goes really wrong. So I guess we, uh, we're going to have a lot go wrong this time. No, not really. Let's go. <laughs> All right, let's get out here to the stagecoach. Oh Lord, someone over at the Overland Station to the told him source. about this. Why did he tip you off? Charm yeah, well, what'd you tell him? Not something you can learn. I regret to inform you. Very no, I got a feeling you uh paid him off a little bit. Charm. And, a little and a little money. Oh, of course, you paid him for the info. Which I recovered the next day when he met with a. Oh my god, dude. Like he was happy to give us intel like on coaches coming through that we can rob, and he you kill him. Right to us. Jesus. Too much dead Moron. We need to be leaner so we can move faster, quieter. I mean, I'm not going to disagree with that, but Five Jesus. Well, Find someone willing to give you tips about making money. So you take the tip, world, you pay him, you kill him, we'll and you take our money back. Now we can't get tips. Hey, the world. I like you boys. Yeah, there's a pretty big price on your head there, Micah. We are wedded in this chaos for better or for worse at this point. Yeah. Cowards move to Thanks a lot there, now. Micah. Not like John did. Jesus. About disappearing on you fellers. Yeah, what about it? Wasn't it? Something like that. I don't trust him. I've been talking to Dutch. Feels to me. Oh, you like think you, you think he's sticking us out with some info Dutch, to the feds? I know you have your doubts about him too, Morgan. I got doubts about you, Micah. Here, it'll be quicker. I got no doubts about John. I've known him for fifteen years. Well, if we really Jesus. are gonna escape somewhere like me and Dutch have been talking about, we're oh, what, to Tahiti? Cut some loose. Yeah, how about well, we Dutch cut you loose? Are looking pretty good again. We yeah, you're welcome for that, by the way. We half the dead wood. We ain't doing that. Yeah, we that ain't a good idea. Um, what? Get a piece of every damn dollar I bring in. They take care Everyone of camp. Their share. I don't see <clears> you <throat> the finger out camp. Yeah. Swanson does his share. Molly, come on. Well, that's different. See, th Wait. This is what? what I mean. Okay. Here we no, are. No, Molly does plenty around camp. Thank you very much. I'll get the explosives planted. Coach should be coming through any minute now. All right, you want me to hold the coach up? Hey, I don't know why we're using explosives. Just freaking blow their heads off. Should be 
Plenty fine. Set them in the road over here so he can blow it as he comes over the bridge. Got some good cover over here. All right. You hide behind this tree to my left, Morgan. Williamson, you take the other side. There we go. Now we're going to wait on this coach. Oh, Lord. What happened there? I hit the charges like he said to. God damn it. Let's get after him. This is not good. He said shoot the charge. I shot the charge. God dang it. Okay, okay, go to the repeater. There we go. That's them down. Come on, girl. Come on. Come on. Get going. God dang it, I shot his hat off. Yeah, screw this. Stop. There we go. Bye bye. There we go. Everybody's down. Everybody's done for. Oh, wait, hold on. Y'all gonna take him out or you need me to? Bye bye. <laughs> Good lord, y'all are worthless when it comes to shooting. Luke Cow. Yeah, yeah, yeah. All right, let's loot this thing up. Got it. No, we're looking good. All right. Best we get out of here. We'll split that up later. I trust you, cowpoke. All right, let's see. Real quick. Uh, dynamite. Yeah, fire bottle. There we go. Go ahead and torch that. We did not get much out of that, by the way. I think we got 50 bucks out of that. That was that was not a good split there, dude. Not a good split. We got us a stranger down here in San Denis. Let's go see what that's about. Because um, I thought we were basically on just main missions now. But let's go see what they want. Hold on. We got someone here preaching Chelonianism. I don't know. I don't know. Does it make me money? Well, I hope so. It is a fascinating religion that was taught to a very wise master okay. about a hundred years ago. So it's a very young very religion. Got it. Take a book. Not sure how I feel about that. Yeah, we might as well take the pamphlet. Okay. You've made a wonderful choice. It Thelonian is a handbill. Of safety. A religion made by gods who understood what life is not uh -huh. what it could be but what it is it is very dangerous you're talking to a guy what, running around with a hundred rounds of what looks like 45 on a bandolier what's all in this book uh, am i boring you kinda i'm sorry have a wonderful day yep yeah, yep yep i'll try Although I'm kind of curious. A handbill dealing with the ways. Okay, let's read this real quick. Uh, you can pause the read. I'm going to read through and just see what it says. Oh my God. It's basically, yeah. That's just, it, it's equilinarianism or equalism or whatever it's called and some other crap thrown in there from Christianity if I'm not mistaken alrighty what's going on with y'all three gentlemen here oh hi what's up buddy he looks a little familiar I believe we met that ghastly party oh yeah right unfortunately so mr Arthur Morgan. Morgan. Sometimes. Uh, can I say something? I think we gave a different name at the party. The mayor thinks you robbed him. Oh, I didn't rob him. Uh, to be clear, 
He wasn't very upset about it. Why would I rob He'd the mayor? You. Okay. Do you, uh, I well, mean to say, uh, can you steal things? Is there a reason you're asking I mean, me to yeah. incriminate myself, Mr. Mm -hmm. Miller? Well, I'm sorry. Have you met? <laughs> this is Rain's. No. Okay, okay, so this is the guy that was dealing with the Indian so, chief and such. I'm okay. Sorry when the wagon train crossing the river at Cumberland Falls. And at the party, you were upstairs. Is there something you need? Ask my people if we are even a people anymore. We've you are, hard. definitely. We've made peace treaties, and those treaties were broken. And we've mm -hmm. been moved and punished and punished and moved. But what do you need me to do to help you out? Now I am told we are to be moved again. Clearly, contravening Why? the peace treaty signed three years ago. This will lead to war. No, I would son, like it not. not to. We could not fight another war. They have got stronger, and we have become far weaker, Mr. Morgan. Mm, it's a bad bit. Weaker in what sense? Oil. Like, you know, I know it is, but I need the your proof. bodies are weaker, or I you don't have the ammunition. Who were on their land a few months ago? Who have filed reports with Leviticus Cornwall and the state government? Oh God, Cornwall! Yes, please let me screw Cornwall under. over somewhere. I'll do whatever I can to screw Cornwall over. You want me to try and steal it? Obviously, they sounds can't. like fun. And Let's do it. More obviously, I would be useless. <clears throat> Listen, I realize that it is a ridiculous request, but we're very desperate. I'm not a do-gooder, Mr. Miller. But we can do a little bit of good. I'm very sorry for your predicament, but. I'm a working man. I got problems of my own. We will pay you very handsomely, Mr. Morgan. Oh, oh, oh. Um, How much? I didn't want money for this, but... Mercenaries. <laughs> oh, duh. There's a price on my head in two states, my friend. The government doesn't like me any more than it does you. Like you, I've been running for as long as I can remember. Yeah, probably like longer. You. My time here is now undone. Now, is that foreshadowing that we're going to die at the end of the game? You meet my son in a couple of days near Citadel Rock, just west of the oil fields. Okay. We are very grateful for your help. Gentlemen, an appointment with the senator. We should mm -hmm. head over there. It's a waste of our time. And his... We must try everything. That's a really nice Come suit on. the chief has. All right, let's go steal well, some plans. The counselor wants to apologize. He can see you now. We've been waiting, I don't know how long. Or next month, if you'd like to reschedule. Come. Perhaps the senator won't mind waiting. Hopefully he won't. Meet eagle flies near Cornwall, kerosene, and tar. Okay. Ain't that a good ways off? Near Cornwall, kerosene, and tar. I know where that's at. I just gotta find it again real quick. Hey, a stranger popped up over here. Let's quickly check this out real quick. I'm gonna assume the stranger we're meeting is this guy. Uh, you good there, buddy? Fantastic. You Americans are nothing but shysters and traitors and slippery uh, bulls. Huh. I'm inclined to agree. Yeah, You're quite inclined, actually. Place. Back to work. The bloody smile. What are you working no on? Problem, Marco. You are the great genius. So we shall the hot poker up the ace. Say thank you, Marco. <laughs> thank you. Thank you. Oh my God! I've never heard that one. I am a fucking genius with poker up the ass, like I say. Okay. Hello. Do I look like I should entertain children? No, not really. No. No, he says. No. <laughs> but what are you making? I am the savior of the man. Honestly. Buddy. Yes. You meet him. Professor Marco Dragic. <laughs> Marco Dragic. Dragic. Literally, however the yes. hell he said. He told the shit, man. So, uh, you make an RC boat? It is not a toy, big nuts. It is demonstration of my genius. Of my ideas about the source of life. Oh, it's a toy boat. 
Yes, it is a toy ball that I can power remotely using electricity in ways you cannot see. Good for you. Wait. Wait. Okay, so I made an RC boat. Still, the investors will not come. Just a couple of old ladies and a moron. <laughs> ladies, please. <laughs> Okay, let's see this uh, remote control boat you made. Okay, uh, how is the piles? Yeah, good, good, good. Okay, my friends, you are about to witness history. All right, let's see this. I'm, I'm curious now. All of us, we feel old. You, you are old. But maybe Damn, dude. You an ass. <laughs> Using waves you cannot see. I will power this. You're a goddamn fraud. And this buffoon dressed up like a buffoon is a stupid. I watched Wait, that what? Are you morons? I never met this buffoon before two minutes ago. Isn't that right? Which part of it? So, Professor, show us your magical toy boat. Yeah, I'm, I'm kind of curious to see this. Check if there's any funny business. No, this ain't nothing to do with me. Come, please, please. Uh, oh, okay. Easy. Any moron could do it, and I am about to prove that. Here, take this, and this, and uh, don't touch that. All right, so we're going to... This one's to steer, and this one to shoot torpedoes, okay? All right, so we yes, accelerate this way. Blow up the little battleships, and, and avoid the sea mines. They have magnets attached. Make a nasty explosion if they touch the bomb. Okay, okay, okay. Okay. We're good. Fire. Oh, this is kind of fun. In the hands of okay. Yo, he literally made like a remote control detonating torpedo sub. Or no torpedo boat. This is kind of cool. I, I'm digging this. This is legitimately kind of cool. I like this. Wait, I want to play with it more. I want to play with it more. I don't want to bring it back. Uh. <laughs> Moving dots. <laughs> I can hit the friggin' landmines. All right, all right, here you go. This is really fun. Is that literally a magazine of torpedoes? That is so cool. Okay, let me let me go. Let me go. Now the dimwit will use invisible waves to destroy the little sailing boats before they get to the other side of the park, still avoiding the magnetic mines. Oh, you have to at least just... You're not here for this smart talk. Oh my god, hitting them when they're moving the is really hard. The telegraph machine, the motor car. They will all seem pedestrian in comparison to this technology. We are hey, I got that one. On the wire, sort of coal or gasoline. No, just got that one. Like right, where, where's the next one? Yellow? Oh, God. I hit that one kind of close. Okay, okay, okay. We're just going to circle around. Got it. Oh, this is so cool. I really like this. Oh. Uh-oh. I didn't know you could kill it. I didn't know it would actually let me fire it. Shit. Okay, I'm gonna redo that. Okay, here we go. That was that was a lot of fun. Thank you, thank you. Can I get one of these just to go screw around in the life, sir? It's incredible. No, no. Yeah, really. Incredible things are in my lap back at Dover Hill. It's like a little remote control boat with a torpedo. 
and I count. Uh oh, those. we're screwing around with stuff. No, this is expensive. <laughs> it is immortality, sir. It is, Ow. It is very cheap. Perhaps over lunch. Maybe. I'm gonna go. Oh, yeah. Of course. <laughs> Later. And thank you. Um, if you're ever up near um, here, sure. pay me a visit. There. Can, can I, like, play with the boat some more? I would really like to play I with the torpedo boat a little more. My, uh, that was a lot of fun. A bright bouncing boy. There we go. Ooh, we eagle flies finally spawned in. It is all the way up near Valentine. Holy cow. Well, let's fast travel to Valentine and hop down here to eagle flies. And we need to steal some documents from Cornwall, Kerosene, and Tar. All right, eagle flies. How we doing this, buddy? How we doing this? Doing all right there, bud? You came. Of course I of came. Course I came. I There's a foreman. His I, mean, name is Denver. I may not be a do-gooder, but I keep my word. It's that window with the blind drawn up. I see. If the okay. files are as incriminating as we believe, Mr. Cornwall's men will destroy them if they know you're coming. There's only one of me, son. I don't intend for them to know I'm coming. What will the file say? <laughs> There'll be a report from Leyland Oil Development Company. All right. So we're yes. only looking yeah, for a singular a document. Sneak into this place. You could crawl under the fence or hide in a wagon. They keep rolling in. I'm going to take a look. If I mean, wagons a problem, wouldn't be a... I thought the whole point was that this had nothing to do with you. I did. Yeah. Man, a wagon seems like a smart choice. You could climb into the back of that wagon. All right, let's go, let's go, let's go. There we go. All righty. Let's get a little bit of a cinematic entrance here. All right, let's go, buddy. We're sneaking into this place. Let's go. Need to get that document. Are we just literally sitting in the back of this thing, by the way? Like, we're not going in covered or anything? No, no. We're just sitting there. That is actually kind of pretty, honestly. I like the old Western feel of this game. It is, uh, it's very aesthetically pleasing. All right, get out of that. Crouch down, we're gonna get over here. That you out? Hey, yeah, it's him. It Doing it. Yeah, I'm supposed to meet the early train to San Denis. Okay, better get a move on then. Okay, okay, he didn't look in the wagon. Good, he didn't see me. Alright, out right here. There we go, there we go. Can I come out of first person, please? Oh. Game didn't think I would just up and get out of the wagon. go I did not want to break the window dang it okay can't go in through there making too much noise there man I need to get around to the other side of this thing nobody see me but just in case they do don't think I want to go in there. I want to try and get in up top. I go up here. Yeah. All right. Up here. Is there any way in up here? Yeah. Look at that. It can't go in through the roof hatch. Is there a ledge or... Oh, there is a ledge. Good. 
I will drop onto that. I can't go in any of these windows. I thought I could get into one of these windows. It looked like they were open earlier. Dang it. I was hoping I could just go in through the window. He's in his office. I go in from behind him. Wait, who saw me? They destroyed the documents? Ow! When? God dang, all right. Let's see where this starts us back at. God damn it. All right, I'll meet y'all back in the stinking, uh, what do you call it? You know what I mean. The factory. All right, we're back here at the factory. I'm just going to try and go in this top door right here. See if it actually opens. Nope. Okay. So we do have to go in through the bottom. Well, it ain't a hunter video if we don't freaking fail once. Or twice. Oh, there's a lot of fellers in here, ain't there? Okay. Yeah, yeah, here we go, here we go. Now we just gotta get up top. Don't you turn around, you keep sleeping there, boy. You keep sleeping. Yeah, there we go. I think that's the guy that saw me originally. You know what? He ain't gotta get a chance to see me again. Hey, go in there, bud. Don't care if that loses me honor. All right, here we go. Here we go. Uh, you must be Danbury. Who? Yeah. <clears throat> what? That ain't gonna work when the when it swings outward, there, bud. How's it going, buddy? Yep, get up. Danbury. Yes. I need some papers, my friend. Nothing important. A file. I'm from head office. Uh-huh. You're not from head office? Yes, I am. Does that seem important right now? Come on, give it to me. A file by the Leland Oil I need it. Now, the one about the oil near Wapiti. I, I, you what? Give me the stinking file. Think, man. The mind is a terrible thing to lose, especially over uh -huh. such a nice I... floor as this. It's here. It's here. There you go. Good boy. Give me the file. Let's go. Thank you there, sir. Danbury. Real good. They'll give you a promotion for this. Nope. Danbury. Danbury? Danbury. You okay? Tell the guard. He's fine. fine. Yes. All's fine. Now stay quiet. Head office uh -huh. me back to get you. You better be quiet. I'm gonna replace both those eyeballs with lead. Well, see, why couldn't I have done this in the first place? Hey, 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 hold it right there. Weapons on the ground. Oh, you're hey, joking, hey, right? Easy now, fellas. Now we won't tell you again. Oh god! Is it really gonna matter if you miss or not? Cause I sure ain't. I 
Bye-bye. No, you ain't. Yeah, you can call me every name in the book. I really don't care. Holy smokes. Look, I don't want to kill more of y'all than I have to. Yeah, 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 I'm coming, I'm coming. Quickly. Hey, now, I only killed the ones I had to there, dude. Holy smokes, I didn't think that was where that was gonna go. go Woo. well good let's get freaking hightailing it out of here don't need to hang around any longer than we already have well good put you in a split point that explosion came just in time yeah no kidding watch some of that oil burn so you met mr danbury yeah oh yeah we met him all right mm-hmm very kind. I thought you wasn't getting involved. Thought you were going to enter and leave silently. Thank you. I did. Save my life. Thank you. I hope. Although, well, you know. I don't know what I hope. I, I didn't really Who have knows? a choice when it came to the people catching use. me when I fell off the Here's roof. Your money. Thank you. I kind of feel bad taking the money. But how much did that get us? 250 so we get 125 please tell me we got a gold on that Is that american fathers too yeah yes we did get a gold infiltrator fa factory by hiding in the wagon get there undetected kill the pursuers and 80 percent accuracy heck yeah ain't gotta redo that mission i like that now, let's see. What are we going to do next? Well, I think we're going to go down here and see what this stranger is right here. Always fun doing stranger missions. Yep. Hey, it's a little encampment. Oh, oh, yeah, definitely will. What you got hanging there? The name's William. That doesn't look like lettuce. Wonder if that's Arthur, some you familiar with other kind of lettuce. Friend, familiar ain't. The word yeah, use. what is it, herbology? Well, let me tell you. This great earth beneath our feet can provide everything uh -huh. that ever needs. But we've only reached a time. Well, yeah, no kidding. Potential. You see, there are thousands. Hey, right, what kind of other of potentials? All across this vast country we share. The mountains, the plains, the swamps. I mean to explore them all. To know all of nature's okay. bounty and all of her wonder. If I can. Sure. But I'm well, that sounds like a pretty good, uh, Would you, consider helping you know, me with gathering goal. Herbs for my studies? Why? Yeah, Knowledge, what do you need? Kindness. Beauty. Well, I'm... Knowledge and kindness. Ugly. Uh... Nasty. <laughs> yeah. Well, let's see if maybe we can do something about that. I'll see. Okay. What you got then? What do you need us to do? I'm looking for a plant called yarrow. You can distinguish it by its red flowers. Hey, we've already it got yarrow. Be too hard to find. They thrive out in the open under direct sunlight. I mean, we we already have yarrow. So here you go. I thought it was pronounced yarrow. <laughs> hey, let's see how I got us some good honor. Yeah, go on, eat it there, buddy. Oh, yeah. I feel better already. They were right. I mean, yarrow this is a pretty good medicine. Does have medicinal properties. Duh. It's yarrow. All this help, uh, you deserve something in return. Well, this is for your horse, actually. Okay. We'll take the horse remedy. Was it like horse reviver or horse Save stimulant? Bad injuries. Heaven horse reviver. Horses in trouble. You'll be glad you had it. Now, Speaking of horses, in tomorrow's to video, to we're going to be getting the technically best horse in the game that you can get for free. 
I think I you can, can actually get it right there at, uh, All the best I think it's chapter Thanks, two. Arthur. And to you. All right, is that it? Yep, that's everything with William. Got it. Later, bud. Hey, Mr. Marco Dragic is up north of Ansberg. Let's go see what he's got. Considering, you know, we need to unlock some of that map up that way anyway. So, I didn't realize this, but there is a Amberino, like sign up here that's kind of cool didn't realize that was here huh quite neat and it's on the railroad track i'm not sure how i feel about the background music that's playing while i'm up in this area this is also the area that we camped out and then got ambushed by some like hillbilly type people like not not like the you know you you call them you know oh you're a hillbilly you live up in the mountains in a nice house no this is like wrong turn or dead end hillbilly type family oh whoa what is this place okay um you got me relatively interested now here buddy go ahead and get that back out Okay, so this is What was his name again? Oh, it's no longer here What the world I rode all the way up here because of that Uh Well that kind of sucks Maybe it's like a specific time of day I can't tell what that says. What does it say? 7... 7.23? Hmm. Well, let's just take a look around here real quick. There might be somewhere that we can... camp for the night. Alaskan ginseng. Yes, please. Looks like a giant Tesla coil. Man, it really does. I think it is a giant Tesla coil. I... I... I think that's what this is, is a giant Tesla coil tower. Yeah, it has to be. Or it's modeled after uh, Frankenstein's monster. Yeah, it looks like somebody started a secondary coil right here. Or would that be primary since... Well, no, because the iron core goes inside... I, I don't exactly remember. All right, we're going to go up here and camp until morning and see if that'll get it to respawn. Okay, apparently that was before 8 a.m. noon, or 8 a.m. in the morning. Well, yeah, I said a.m. I'm going to sleep until noon and see if the quest pops back up. All right, leave camp. It popped back up. No. Oh, there is a legendary elk up here. Oh, I think we're about to go hunting a legendary animal. Yeah. While we wait on him, we're going to go look around for a legendary animal. Why did my controller already vibrate? Oh, it's because of these the mushrooms. I'll actually pick these. Oh, oh, I see the little gold thing right up here for the legendary elk. Let's go look at it real quick. Ah, some markings on a tree. Or is that mo Nope, nope, That's that is tree rub. We got. Uh, and I have the correct... You know what? We got explosive ammo. We might as well use it. All right, let's go find him. Crack him over here. Wait, hold on. Hmm. I think I saw the little gold thing over here. Or just see it right out the gate. Nope, never mind. It's Rocky Mountain Bull Elk. Okay, okay. There, there's the next sign. Go ahead and go over here. It's probably going to be poop, right? Yep, it's poop. 
Moose poop. It ain't close. Way to go. That way? Okay. Give me an ain't. Well, never mind. There's already elk around us. And turkey, apparently. And turkey. Okay, more. Nope, those are tracks, aren't they? No, fur. Okay. I did not. Oh, it's a little tough to fur. Little tough to fur. Oh, good lord, look at that big boy. Legendary moose. That is a massive stinking animal. Real quick. I'm using some cover scent. I do not want him seeing me. Wow. God dang it. No, 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 no. Go down, buddy. There we go. And remember, you don't have to worry about what you're using against them. They're legendaries. It's always going to be a legendary hide, and you can't mess it up. Look at that big boy there. Holy cow. All right, let's skin him up. God, look at how big this dude is. Not even sure what we could use a legendary moose pelt for. Yeah, get those antlers. God, look at how big that antler was. There we go. Legendary moose pelt. Let's see what the compendium says. As endemic to Roanoke Ridge, New Hanover, this moose can be recognized by its larger size and short, light gray hair. Omnivore diet includes shoots from willows. Let's see. The best way to hunt this animal is considered to be either be a bow with improved arrows or a long scope rifle. Killing this animal will give you the opportunity to craft a rare trinket. Yes. Oh, oh, I'm so excited about that. Now we just got to go, uh, go talk with Gus. And see what we can get. Alrighty, so we're gonna get the Moose Antler Trinket for $19. Permanently increased player's health experience bonus by 10%. And just requires one legendary Moose Antler. Let's go ahead and craft that up. We still need the Elk, Coyote, Cougar, Beaver, and a lot of others. Oh, Lord, there's a lot of others. Great. Okay. Remember you. Well, fun, fun. Let's see. We got what? Four of these? Yeah, I think we've only gotten four of those. Great. We're going to grab the high roller revolver as well because why not? And while we're here and we have an absolute crap ton of money. We have basically bought him out of all of his documents so that we can learn how to make all the stuff he wants us to make or lets us make. And we also, you know, grabbed all of these. Hey, it works. Uh, we'll equip that one, actually. All right, uh, let's see what we're going to do for the rest of the video. Let's actually run down to Shady Bell, turn all these pelts in, and then we'll see if that's going to be the end of the video, probably. All righty, we're going to sell this legendary moose pelt to him. Just saying, Boy, we might as well. There ain't nothing this. we're going to really do with it. And with that, that is going to be end of... Uh, oh, you can now use legendary moose pelt to craft garments. Oh, okay, so basically we sell it to him and we can use it later. Kind of like donating to camp. Got it. But with that being said, that is going to be the end of this episode. Hope you enjoyed. If you did, remember to like, subscribe, click that notification bell, drop a comment down below, and as always, enjoy hunting your shiny trophies.